So are you trying to feed your family on a budget? We all know buying healthy foods can be costly. So Leslie hit the streets to see what your grocery concerns are and to get tips on how to save. Well, I'm on the street asking people what's their biggest grocery store concern? The cost of everything. Everything is just sky high. Do you use coupons? Uh, yeah, I do. And I look in the sales papers and I get my best deal even if I have to travel to different locations to get the best for my dollar. What's your biggest grocery store concern? Just watching the prices go up every week. Penny by penny by dollar by dollar. I don't like paying rent on grocery store property. They really are concerned about money these days, and they want to make sure that their families have healthy food to eat, but they also don't want to spend a lot of money. And unfortunately, with the changes in the economy in the past few years, people have really cut back on buying healthy food, and that doesn't have to be. It's nutritional value, um, what's in your food, the ingredients, if it's organic. I'm, I mean, obviously, you don't want to spend a lot of money, but I shop at Whole Foods and stuff because I want good things going in my body. Fresh, organic, but usually the like artificial colorings or so forth that they put into to make tomatoes look better or whatever or just hosing them down just to make them look fresher doesn't do it for me. Well the great thing about organic and healthy foods is now they're available in a lot of you know mass retailers throughout the country you know stores like Walmart and Target are all on this bandwagon now so you can get a lot of really healthy organic food inexpensively. Do you go for certain choices when you're at the grocery store? Yeah sure but I also use the coupons and the circulars and I know what I need and I take a list with me and I don't overspend because I have my list so I get what I need when I need it. I think the key thing is to write a menu for the full week and I know that sounds daunting at first but just you know Monday through Friday write out you know breakfast lunch dinner what you're gonna have it doesn't have to be really descript and then also try to look at your circulars and see what's on sale and kind of plug some of that stuff in. Then from that, you write a list, and when you take that list to the grocery store, stick to it. Thanks for that, Leslie. Sticking to your list at the grocery store is a good tip, but did you know that if you strategically purchase an item during a certain month, you can actually save so much money? 